Hi, this is Saraswati. Welcome back to my YouTube channel Brahma Saraswati. Today's class I am going to explain procedural assignments. In this video, I cover the topics of first one, what is procedural assignments? Second one, syntax for procedural assignments. Third one, list the types of procedural assignments. Fourth one, blocking assignment. Fifth one, non-blocking assignment. First topic is what is procedural assignments? First point, procedural assignments are the assignment statement used within Verilog procedures. Or second point, procedural assignments are the assignment statement used within always an initial blocks. You see the Verilog procedures words in the first point. This words means Verilog procedures are two types always block and initial block you have to write a statements between the begin and end in the always block or in the initial block that statements are called procedural assignments or assignment statements these two points are also called as a definition of the procedural assignments i give the two types of syntaxes you see on the display first syntax is always block syntax second one is the initial block syntax you observe always block syntax is used to write in normal verilog program or rtl modeling program and initial syntax is used in test bench program if you want to write a test bench for a normal program then you write the initial block in the test bench you observe the first syntax always at the rate of passage clock begin statement 1 statement 2 end you write the always always block always block consists of the at the rate of symbol and the events the events means passage clock next it is continue with the begin between the begin and end block there are the statements we written as per the program these statements are called the procedural assignments it is the same as the initial block also in syntax 2 initial begin statement 1 statement 2 end between the begin and the end we write the statements this initial program is written in the test benches the second topic is syntax for the procedural assignment we see the syntax on display syntax for the procedural assignment variable equal to expression first of all variable equal to expression equal to symbol left side is a variable and equal to symbol right side is a expression variable is a left side expression is a right side you observe that you see the first point the left hand side of the procedural assignment equal to symbol is the only rich variables and integers this point means the left side of the equal to symbol is a variable this variable is a register variable or integers the next point is the right hand side of the procedural assignment equal to symbol is an expression which may use any of operator types like arithmetic logical relational shift conditional operators etc this point means after the equal to symbol we write a expression this is a right hand side so in this expression we write the operator types the operator types are the like arithmetic logical relational shift conditional operators or etc you observe the syntax variable equal to expression here variable is a output terminal and expression is a relation between the inputs output equal to relation between the inputs okay this variable is a storage element the output is a storage element and input relations are executed and stored in the output variable for example y equal to a plus b y is a variable and a plus b are a expression the expression a plus b are executed and stored the this result in the y this is called variable equal to expression in this slide, we discuss the delayed assignment and intra assignment delay. These two topics. And you observed hash delta t. Here, hash delta t means time, time units. And first one, delayed assignment. In first point, in a delayed assignment, hash delta t time units 
pass before the statements is executed and the left hand in assignment is made this point means the time delay is specified before the variable this is called delayed assignment you observe the syntax for the delayed assignment on display hash delta t variable equal to expression for example example also i given hash 3 the time is it will be a milliseconds microseconds or seconds hash 3 a equal to b plus c the time delay is specified before the a with the 3 seconds the next one is intra assignment delay the first point with the intra assignment delay hash delta t time units right side is evaluated immediately but there is a delay of delta t before the result is placed in the left hand assignment this point simply means the time delay means hash delta t is specified after the equal to symbol and before the expression you observe the intra assignment delay syntax variable equal to hash delta t expression i give you example z equal to hash 5 b plus c the hash 5 delay is specified before the b plus c expression you observe the time delay is specified before the variable it is called delayed assignment the time delay is specified after the equal to symbol and before the expression it is called as intra assignment delay the third topic is types of processal assignments there are two kinds of processal assignments first one is blocking assignment second one non blocking assignment the next topic is fourth one blocking assignment first point blocking assignments denoted by the equal to symbol second point procedure or blocking assignments are done sequentially in the order the statements are written this point means in blocking assignments the statements are executed in sequential order sequential order means executed one after one statement that means if the statement one is executed after that the statement will be the statement two will be executed after statement two the statement three will be executed one after another in the order the statements be written the next point is a second assignment is not started until the preceding one is complete this point means already i told the first statement one is executed after that the statement two will be executed after completion of one the next will be started the statement two is not started until the statement one is complete the next point is for combinational circuits only blocking assignments should be used this point means if you want to write a program for combinational circuits the blocking assignments are the used to write a program and combinational circuits are adders multipliers encoders decoders multiplexers etc you observe the syntaxes on display there are three types of syntaxes first one variable equal to expression it is also called as a blocking assignment syntax or processor assignment syntax and the next one variable equal to hash delta t expression it is also called as in intra assignment delay syntax and third one hash delta t variable equal to expression it is also called as a delayed assignment these three syntaxes are also called as a blocking assignment syntax because between the variable and expression the equal to symbol is displayed or specified that's why it is called as a blocking assignment syntax we see the sample program in test bench program of the blocking assignment on display you see initial begin after initial it is begin and a equal to 1 semicolon b equal to 2 semicolon c equal to 3 semicolon after that hash 5 y equal to b plus c and d equal to y semicolon end between the begin and end we write the blocking assignment statements and first of all we declare the what is the values of a b c then we write the output expression y equal to b plus c y, y is a variable b plus c is a expression hash 5 is a time delay okay you observe the equal to symbol is between the variable and expression 
द फिफ्त टापिक ईज नॉन् ब्लॉकिंग असैनमेंट दिस ईज आलो कॉल एस ए आर्टिल असैनमेंट फस्ट पॉइंट नॉन् ब्लॉकिंग असैनमेंट डिनोटेड बै द लेस् आर् ईक्वल टू सिंबल सेकेंड पॉइंट आर्टिल नॉन् ब्लॉकिंग असैनमेंट विच फॉलो ईच अदर इन दोड आर् डन इन प्यारल दिस पॉइंट मीन इन नॉन् ब्लॉकिंग असैनमेंट द स्टेटमेंट आर् एक्सिक्यूटेड इन parallel parallel means concurrent all our statements are executed at once at the start of the simulation the third point is the right hand side of the non blocking assignments is evaluated starting from the completion of the last blocking assignment or if none the start of the procedure this point means in a program sometimes we write the blocking assignment statements and the non blocking assignment statements both first we write the blocking assignment after completion of the blocking assignment statements we write the non blocking assignment statements the next point is the transfer to the left hand side is made according to the delays this point means the expression is stored in the variable according to the delay the last point is sequential circuits should be designed with non blocking assignments this point means if you want to write a program for sequential circuits the less than or equal to symbol is used in the statements and these statements are executed in concurrent or parallel you observe the syntax on display first one variable less than or equal to expression it is a procedural assignment syntax with non blocking assignment symbol less than or equal to next one variable less than or equal to hash delta t expression it is a intra assignment delay and with non blocking assignment symbol and last one is a hash delta t variable less than or equal to expression it is a delay assignment syntax with non blocking assignment symbol i give you example on display it is a test bench program initial begin we write the statements non blocking assignment statements with less than or equal to symbol first statement one is hash 3 b less than or equal to a it is a statement one semicolon next hash 6 x less than or equal to b plus c semicolon it is a statement two these two statements are the non blocking assignment with the symbol of less than or equal to symbol and end with a keyword end this is the non blocking assignment i already made and uploaded the some of the verilog hdl videos in my channel if anyone want go to the my playlist i hope you understand the procedural assignment concept very well if you are watching first time my video kindly subscribe and support to make lot of videos thanks for watching my channel thank you